Yo guys and welcome to my review of episode 47 of Yu-Gi-Oh! Go Rush. The duel between Yuhi and Damamu, uh, or I guess Dear Damar. Um, and, you know, I'm being repetitive this arc, but another great episode. I mean, uh, not much to say about that. This arc has been really, really good so far uh, with the episodes. I will say... The, my only thing, and this isn't with uh, just Go Rush, it's with basically every Yu-Gi-Oh! show. Um, a lot of times these duels, when there are stakes set, it does become predictable. Now, obviously that, I don't care about that when it's, you know, the arc finale or season finale, whatever. Then it's fine, because, you know, most of the time those uh it's you know the the stakes are uh the end of the world or saving the world right like but in these types of kind of more i guess it, i wouldn't call them meaningless duels but at the same time they are right but it's like you know yuomu isn't gonna stop being the president and you know they're not gonna give up the uts building that that's just not gonna happen so i i don't really like when they do that could it have been a draw sure but most of the time when it's a draw then they you know make it so that both things happen so it's a fair thing um but he, again th this is something that uh it, it's not just this show that does it all of them do it but yeah I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm basically just nitpicking at, at this. Um, I think obviously the biggest talking point of this episode, at least to me, is the start with Kawhi Tell, where he says that uh, your Damar uh, is constantly evolving and in some way you he's devolving because so the earth damar uh kind of takes the personality of you he and you know his uh childish happiness right and his excitement for everything his joy and you he becomes more and more boring in some ways um now i do have a theory so with when the Erdamar was in Yomu, it was obviously still evolving from, you know, the information it got from Yuhi. I do wonder because, you know, it's been established in the show that uh, Yomu is a better duelist than Yuhi. That, um, you know, it could be that it's going to drain Yomu's power as well. It could not be. It could just be that it's, you know, it's... Uh, using the amount of, you know, dueling ability that I took from Yuhi, right? When, when Kawhi Tell stole the Erdamar, the first thing we know about that is that uh, Yuhi got worse at dueling from that point. Um, so it could just be that, but I wouldn't be surprised if the next time Yuomu duels, she isn't, you know, as good as she normally would be. Um, but that that's very interesting, and uh, it makes things a lot weirder now because if you he does become this kind of unemotional thing, it would make sense why he would maybe join the opposing forces of Felgir in season two. Uh, so that I think that's very very interesting. Um, also, we now learn that uh, the pads that Manabu and Rovier, Rovian were on have kind of an emergency oxygen thing if they get thrown uh, into space, so that's nice. Um, and the, the fact that they've now sent so many people to search for them, I'm kind of feeling that we are definitely going to see that theory that we've all had where Yuga and the Lug will save them. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, I think it was a very fun episode. The duel itself, uh, I thought it was good. Um, Tamabot 
having two fusions in one episode was... I mean, it, it's definitely weird. Tamabot is kind of, you know, Yuhi's Karibo in a way, so... Yeah, that, I thought that was uh, kind of fun. Um, so yeah, o overall, I think it was a pretty solid duel. We, now, at the at very end, we see Yordamar uh, take Z uh, Yuhi and Muda Welgear to Zvijo, uh and then the episode ends. Um, so we, we know that Yuhi is going to confront Zvijo next week. Uh, what's going to happen with Yuam and Yordamar, we're going to have to see. But um, yeah, that, those were kind of my quick thoughts on the episode. I think it was... It was definitely fun, and uh, I think now we are in that proper, you know, end of the arc situation where UDS is gonna head to Zuijo, and we're going to probably have like one or two more duels, and then it's gonna be the finale. So um, I'm very excited uh, for that, and you know, as always, you guys tell me your thoughts. What do you think is gonna happen with Yuhi and Yurdamar? Do you think uh, Yuhi will become this kind of un uh, emotionless machine, or do you think that maybe what happened here with the UTS-8 maybe fixed it completely, which I doubt, but yeah, tell me your guys' thoughts in the comments, and I'll see you guys next time.